All right, so we're getting ready for this next match, and it promises to be a doozy. Uh, let's give a little history as to why this match is happening. Last week at Journey Through Hell 2, Dawn of Darkness, as you see the alien coming out, um, the alien and Jack Torrance met in the tournament first round match uh, for the Dark Side title. I'm sure I jumbled those words together, but stick, stick with me here, please. Uh, no, there was a tournament at Journey Through Dark Side 2 to crown the Dark Side champion, a new Dark Side champion, a first Dark Side champion. And in the first round, it was Alien and Jack Torrance in a hell in a cell match, which is brutal. And that usually ends it. However, these guys, or I guess this guy and this alien, battled it out. It was an epic encounter. I mean, they'd nearly killed each other. And then they just kind of stared each other down and refused to fight. Oh, oh, oh. Like after, I don't know, 10, 20 minutes of just nonstop action, they just called it, holy crap. We'll, we'll get back to the story in a second. Let's take a second to talk about Jack Torrance. I mean, this zombie Jack? Did he just crawl out of that hedge maze, frozen? He just thaw out? My God, this is this is something else. So, anyways, as I was saying, these guys, after putting each other through hell, just stop fighting for whatever reason. And so, anyways, uh, referee had no decision but to. Uh, Called a no contest, which made nobody happy. But uh, either way, you know, these two were both eliminated from the tournament. So the board directors decided, you know what? No, we need a winner between you two. Even if it's not for the title now, it's going to be, you know, you guys fighting tonight at Horror Mania 2. And they have chosen the last man standing rule. So again, we're going to see these guys beat the hell out of each other. And my God, I mean, look at Jack Torrance. All snowbound. Looks like he's got big time dandruff, but that's definitely the snow. And he's just throwing it. That's the thing. Jack Torrance shows no fear to this alien. I mean, that's the thing. You know, I don't know who to give the uh, advantage to because initially I would have thought at Journey Through Hell 2 that these guys. It would have been an alien just dominating Jack. I mean, he's a freaking alien for Christ's sake. And then you block him in a cell with him where Jack would have nowhere to run. But Jack didn't run. Jack kept putting it to him. Like I said, just until that odd moment where they both decided to stop. Oh, stop fighting. But uh, here, same thing. It's like you got to give the advantage, I would think, to the alien. But Jack's not going to stop. Jack's going to bring it to him no matter what. So it promises to be a hell of a match here. Even though the Alien franchise is a long one, uh, this Alien in particular only had one film. He was in the first one. I always thought it would be kind of cool. I'm going to go off on a tear here. Uh, if they ever did like another Alien movie, and it's just a spaceship flying through space, around the same time that part one's happening, and then this alien just pops out. Because this alien was never really killed, per se. Like, he can breathe out there in, you know, the nothingness. Oh, God. Count started already after that insane bulldog there. Is Jack out? Nope, Jack's getting back up. But uh, it'd be neat to see OG Alien just hovering through space. And he just attaches himself to another spaceship that has no idea what's going on. And then the aliens are still. That's just my, my opinion. This is my thought. I think it would be a really cool way to bring back the original alien. And at the same time, you know, get us another awesome alien movie. Jack's down yet again. I can't tell if he's actually dead or that's just the way he looks. Oh, there he's moving. He's not dead. He's not dead, everybody. Grady woke him up. We're fine. Oh, but a massive spear. And that may do it right there. That may do it right there. And the alien just dancing. Just dancing above it. And I was going to say, for the longest time, Jack Torrance only had one movie. Well, I guess he had two. He had the uh, shiny mini. Oh, he. The alien broke the count here. That's kind of an unusual choice there. Oh, man. Just putting the boots to him. 
and now we're getting the uh, the count. I guess they only decided, you know, wasn't enough to put Jack down. Gonna have to hit him again. No, but for the longest time, Jack only had one movie and one miniseries under his belt. But he did return in Doctor Sleep. It wasn't Jack Nicholson, mind you, but still pretty pretty impressive, nonetheless. Doctor Sleep, I don't know, I think that's just a modern masterpiece of a film. I don't care what anybody says. I think fans of The Shining love it, the movie. I think people who never really watch Shining and watch as a standalone film, they would love it. And I just feel like, I don't know. It's crazy. I know when The Shining first came out, the critics didn't really like it. It's, it's crazy to me. I loved it. But like I'm, I'm hearing this next generation, this younger generation, talk about how it's just a boring film and stalled and everything else. It's like, what the fuck? Went for that standing moonsault or shooting star yet again, but this time Jack had it scouted. And he's just, he just bitch slapped him. That's what I'm saying. This guy shows no fear at all. And hit him with the choke slam. Hit him with the choke slam. Could that be it? I don't know. Jack standing over him. These aliens like to play possum. Don't get too cocky. Don't get too close to him. Yep, that's what I was saying. I told you. I told you. Now the aliens fight. But look, is that the Jack? Bringing it back to him. Oh, are we going to see the Overlook Edge? Are we going to see the Overlook Edge? Holy crap. Oh, the Overlook Edge. That could be it. That's what I'm saying. You cannot count this man out. He's probably drunk as shit right now. His leg's probably all fucked up. He's hobbling. He's just frozen to death. But that's not enough to stop him. He will go toe to toe. With a freaking alien. No fear, this guy. Oh, got the eight. Jackie. <laughs> he just, you gotta love his swagger. You just gotta love this guy. He's crazy. He's just seriously batshit crazy. But the alien. Oh, brought him down in the hard way. And he's just, he's just twitching at this point. My God. Will he be able to get a four, five? I was saying good. Six, seven. He's getting up. He's he's slowly getting up. But the alien's waiting on him, man. The alien was waiting for him. And oh, look at that! Jack just dumps him to the outside. I don't know what the referee's doing. Is he going to go out there to check on him, or he, he's counting? I guess. Two. We're up to we're up to three right now. Now I always think this alien. I don't know if he can comprehend the competition or not, but I just feel like he has underestimated Jack twice. Once in that hell in a cell and once now. I think he's finally seeing him. There we go. Jack, now if I was Jack, I would have stayed inside. Let the alien come to you. But it seems to be working for him. Oh, dropped him right there on his head. And he goes inside. He's he's confident that it may have done it too. So I was thinking, I'm Jack. I'm grabbing weapons, buddy. I'm getting weapons. I'm arming myself. Man, seven. This could be. Nope, nope. He's stern. And again, Jack goes right after to him. Oh. He has that code breaker. I don't know if he has an alien pun name for that, but referee's going to check on him, and, and Jack's hurt. And this could be it. Now it's the alien in there strutting his stuff. Jack, I don't know if he's going to be able to come back from this or not. And we are up to seven. Eight. Oh my God. Nine. Oh, and he gets up, and the alien comes right to the greeting. But look at this. Kicked him right in the fucking face. He just kicked him right in the face. And man, will that do it? It seems like he's down. The referee is counting it. My God, we're up to six. 
Jack. Seven. Antagonizing your opponent Eight. Could be, no, he's he's getting up. He's getting up. He yeah, see, if I'm Jack, I'd go for the mallet. Or a sledgehammer, you know. There's a mallet in the book. I don't think the, the people would let him bring the... Uh, oh, the old... Uh, axe to the ring, you know. Like, who's this? It's really dark. We're saying it's our truth What's our truth What the fuck? You know, we had Big E interrupt one of these uh, events a while back ago. And now our truth comes in here and attacks him? Now that ain't right. That's just not right. We're not looking for a crossover with WWE and HMW. I'm sorry. We're slightly better than them. That's just all there is to it. And of course, you know, there's, there's no DQ in this match, but what the, what the hell is that? And you can't help but think, but then, you know, if they, if the alien wins, he's going for that choke slam. No, he just, oh, he punched him right in the fucking gut. I mean, this has been an accurate thing. Well, I mean, but Jack recovered pretty quickly. Just proving how much of a pussy our truth is. Oh, he gets Ric Flair off the top rope, though. My God. And the alien goes for the spear, but oh, Jack jumps it. If he hits that that overlook edge, that'll be it right there. That will be it. What's he waiting on? They lock it up. And oh, he goes right over the top. And the referee starts counting. This isn't the smartest thing to do. Now it's kind of dark in the arena. I couldn't tell, like, did he hit his head on the way down? I mean, seems kind of odd that he just went over and he's just laid out right now. Come on. Get get up, Jack. Get up, Jack. Man, he is just... What, nine? I don't think he's getting up. The alien wins. Wow. I'm not going. I mean, I, I ain't saying I didn't see this coming, but I didn't see it coming like this. With just a toss out, win by toss out. That's that's crazy. He really got the better I mean, he he, you know, was quite the display tonight. He, he's coming back. He, you know, even though the alien kind dominated early on, Jack was you know keeping up with him. Our truth interference. He dodged the spear, but in the end, alien won.